Have you been diagnosed with recurring migraines? Contact PRISM Clinical Research for more information about our migraine studies. With Tim Lauder, Tom Hanneman back on a Twins final pitch following a 4-2 Twins loss in Detroit. Cole Stewart in his Major League debut falls a bit short, picks up his first loss uh, in big league pitching. Paul Molitor uh, is changing his lineup, looking at a lot of players right now, and he's doing it, Tim, with a purpose. Well, yeah, you have to find out exactly what it is that you have. As the Twins continue to move forward, uh, take a look at the standings, and uh, with everything that has happened since the trade deadline, uh, again, when these players walk into the clubhouse, this is what they've got. And uh, your first job is to win baseball games, and it's up to the front office, and it's up to the Paul Molitor and his staff to make some evaluations about what they have. And uh, today they got another opportunity to take a look at a young guy they got to see Tom, a young kid, by the name of Cole Stewart on the mound. He's going to be the first of, uh, I think, a few more before the season's end of young guys that get to show up and show their wares. Matt Boyd handcuffed the Twins in this one, allowing just two hits in six innings, four hits for the Twins in the afternoon. As for Cole Stewart, afterwards he assessed his Major League debut. I, mean, I felt good on the mound. Um, I... You know, after the first pitch got out of the way, I, I kind of felt like I uh, settled in a little bit. Um, just, you know, left a few, few too many pitches over the plate a little bit, and, uh, you know, they made me pay for it there in that last inning. Up next for the Twins, starting Tuesday, the Pittsburgh Pirates in town for two games. Oda Rizzi in the opener, Jose Barrios battling Chris Archer Wednesday afternoon. Twins split a two-game series in Pittsburgh in early April. And it's going to be up to these uh, Twins players as they continue to move forward to understand they're there for one reason and one reason only, and that's to win baseball games. Aside from that, when you go to the ballpark, you want to learn something about yourself on a daily basis. Learn something about your teammates. These are the guys that you're going to do battle with. It's going to be up to Paul Molitor and his staff in the front office to determine how things are going to shake out before the season's end. But I, th I still think we're going to see some more younger players in a Twins uniform because they have to find out what they have. Anthony, Tim, and Roy return with the special one-hour edition Twins Live batting practice Tuesday afternoon at 4.30. We hope you'll join us then.